Hello guys! The latest snapshots introduced the shears with a silk touch enchantment which will allow you to pick up the cobwebs. And with the cobwebs you can build a very compact timer for uh, 24 or more seconds. And now you can enchant your mob grinder with a brains and it will detect when you are far away. It will send uh, water waves to show off every mobs on his spawning pads because the mobs can't walk when you are very far away so now you can build a hybrid mob grinder for this I'm using this reversed proximity detector with a NAND gate that will power this rail of the timer the timer will decide when the player is out of the range uh, when the chickens stop going. That means that waves must be sent to show off all the mobs that are accumulated in here. And the second timer that will work on the half of delay will send the pulses for this monostable circuit to the dual edge detector that will send waves. And I'm using here the end gate that will check if this snow golem stays in this powered rail and this rail don't uh, give don't take the signal from this proximity detector and this snow golem falls here then it sends the waves otherwise it won't save the waves and uh, the mob grinder will work on full efficiency unless you are near it. So let's go a bit higher to see what happens. At this range you can see that the chickens are staying on the stone pressure plates. Right now the water is flowing and taking them back on the uh, pressure plates. But when I'm too far away from the mob grinder the chickens will stay on one place and won't be able to walk off the stone pressure plates and that's why the second sno snow golem will never go in the timer again so the waves will be controlled just by the second snow golem that will circling around uh, with a 30 seconds delay and every 30 seconds will have the wave coming out of the dispensers so we must wait when it falls down and then it sends the signal to this dispensers let's wait a bit here it goes and these waves will wa wash off the mobs you can uh, extend the signal a bit more because the waves might not be enough to wash all the mobs but note that when the water is flowing mobs can't spawn here so that is why we need to disable uh, this machine when we are close enough to the mob grinder. That's about it. Thanks for watching.